White House is just heating up, of course, but one Western New York company is already playing a role in the future president's home at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. Kittinger Furniture in Clarence is ready to ship 16 chairs to be used in the Roosevelt Room, just steps from the Oval Office. News Force Marissa Perlman got a look at them today. Marissa? Well, Jackie, this is the latest in a long line of White House related work for Kittinger. Their presidential work dates back to the 70s. The company made furniture for the cabinet room when it was first renovated and for the majority of the West Wing offices. Now, these 16 new chairs will replace the current 12 year old set also produced by Kittinger. The company employees built the chairs from scratch in their factory with high quality mahogany. Now they're upholstered with leather supplied by Garrett Leather, also another local company. It takes about 12 hours just to put that leather on each chair. Kittinger's president says they take their relationship with the White House very seriously. It's something everyone in the company is very proud of. They really take a lot of pride in, a, in the craftsmanship and everybody in the, uh, in the facility takes a tremendous amount of pride in whatever their contribution is, whether they're cutting up an arm or, or assembling the chair or, or putting the leather on. Uh, we, we all take a tremendous amount of pride in, in, in the relationship and maintaining that relationship is extremely important to us. Now, something to note, the furniture will be shipped to a military base just outside D.C. where it can be properly screened before heading to the White House, a protocol that certainly wasn't in place in the 1970s. Live in the studio, Marissa Perlman.